you'll hear more of that fantastic um, fanfare of a piece by Cog Alert in a few minutes after I've told you about the upcoming organ festival. It really is a great privilege and a great honour for me to be able to sit here and announce to you the upcoming inaugural Beauty and Sound Organ Festival starting on this coming Wednesday. Well, what's it all about? Well, it's about sharing the Beauty and uh, Sound platform with other people and allowing artists from around the world to play on this platform in front of you. I've had to make a list of, of everything that's involved because the numbers are just mind-bogglingly high. I hadn't quite realised that we had so many people involved. 27 artists from around the world of all ages are playing, uh, have composed and are just involved in this organ festival. 27, that's incredible. That includes 41 different organ pieces. 41. So that's three organ sonatas and one organ symphony, you know, each of which contain multiple movements. 15 hymns as well. And of course, we will be using multiple organs, including pipe organs. Well, so how on earth do you find out more information? Well, luckily, I've produced for you, and it's just released today, a festival programme. And it looks like this. And you have a beautiful picture of Nancy on the front with our new uh, organ festival logo at the top there, which you've, you've seen, uh, no doubt, on the channel already. It goes into an introduction um, but around the festival and also beauty and sound more generally, how it's developed and where I'd like it to go from yours truly. We then go into the first event on um, the organ festival, which is on Wednesday the 21st, Call for Composers 2. This event on Wednesday is hand on heart far better than I could ever have imagined. When I put out um, the call for composers, that name is just stuck really, it wasn't ever intended to be the title, um, but it's just, it seems to work. I put out the call for composers only a few months ago and I received um, in excess of 50 individual pieces of music and I've been able to um, condense that into 16 pieces and it was really hard to do that because the standard is so high of, um, of musical composition, it's quite extraordinary. And I'm very, very honoured to be able to be playing to you, um, I guess, for a lot of you, the first time these pieces of music. It really is a privilege and it's one of the greatest things I think that I've achieved on this channel to date. Uh, going into Organ Compline, uh, Wednesday the 22nd. Um, those of you who've attended Organ Compline will know that it's basically a spin-off of Virtual Church. It's a, a late night, a very atmospheric, short and quiet uh, service, if you like. It's not really a service, it's more of a meditation. Um, it contains quiet organ music, uh, plain song psalms, hymns, readings and... Um, an organ a voluntary at the end. They're all very quiet, very atmospheric. This uh, particular organ compline, uh, we have people uh, like Chris Bedford, who is uh, reading the reading and the collect, uh, Maurice Coates, who is pr uh, playing the hymn for me, uh, one of the hymns, and introducing it. And the motet at the very end is sung uh, by Swell Vox, accompanied by James Flores. So I'm very grateful to those people for being involved. This takes us into Friday, the 23rd, um, Joint Junior Organ Festival. This is a real privilege for me, and this is one of the beauties of Beauty and Sound. Having a, a platform with um, over 70,000 subscribers, it allows me to share that platform with other people and allow other people from around the world to play on it for you, including these very talented young people. So the, the youngest, is age 12, that's amazing isn't it, he's 12 years old and the youngest, is, sorry, the eldest is 23, so younger than me, I put out a call, uh, a call for 
uh, recitalists um, for at the age of under 30. So it rules me out, unfortunately. <laughs> a lot of talent here, a lot of talent, and a very um, nice and varied programme from modern music to bark and everything in between, including um, some music rich, written by the performing artist. All information is in this programme. Saturday 24th is the festival organ recital. That's me uh, this time around. In the future it will be a guest organist um, playing on the new organ. And I will be playing on this particular Hamsberg organ. This is the, the extended version of Caen. It's not the updated version of Caen. Personally, this extension is better and superior. I'll put more information in the description in due course. And I'm playing the first trio sonata by Bach in E-flat, which you've heard me play uh, before on the Harlem Hamsberg organ. And the sixth organ sonata by Mendelssohn, which is the finest organ sonata by Mendelssohn, in my view, um, also one of the hardest. <laughs> and then also um, the Vidor Symphony Number no. 6 in G minor. Organ symphonies don't really come much better than that, perhaps apart from Vienne's third. This organ symphony is just fantastic. It's loud, it's quiet, it's loud, it's quiet, and then very loud <laughs> in that order. Um, you'll love it. On this organ, it just sounds like, n like nothing else. I promise, it's amazing. You'll really, really enjoy that. And then we'll go into the final day, virtual church on Sunday the 25th. Um, and this is from St. George's Church in Chichester, where there is a beautiful uh, acoustic uh, housing, uh, a very fine uh, two manual 2013 Nicholson organ. Lots of hymns, five organ pieces, an organ demonstration and a Zimbelstern, <laughs> which I demonstrate for you. The voluntary there, by the way, is the Drufle uh, Veni Creator choral variations. And of course, Caroline will be singing the plain song to so look out for that. And then in the program, I actually then go on to talk about the new organ, a little bit more information in here, which you've not yet heard, including an, uh, a design of the console. Hopefully enough information in there to get you as excited about it as I am. And then the final page is some thank yous with a nice picture of the family um, and some social media icons. The link to this PDF is in the video's description and I'll also be sharing it on Facebook and all of those other social media icons that I just uh, pointed to. And I would really appreciate it if you shared them as well with your friends and family and online. So let's go into this um, organ piece, shall we? This is Karg Alert, um, and it is called, it's been, it's been translated into English, um, Praise the Lord with Drums and Cymbals. I think the original title was probably um, Lobet den Herren with um, Mit Pauken und um, Zimbern, possibly. It is by Siegfried Karg Alert, and it's been arranged for organ here by Harold E. Jackson, and it's a bit of a fanfare, it's only about three, four minutes long. Play it on this wonderful organ of core. This is just to whet your appetite for the Vidor uh, organ recital uh, on Saturday. I really look forward to uh, joining you uh, with the, in the organ festival this coming week. Over to the organ. <laughs> 